Yo, yo, what's going on, guys? It's Dansby here, and uh, I just want to apologize to my subs for not posting for a while. I've actually seen my channel grow a little bit over the past three weeks, even though I haven't posted anything. I've, I've gained, like, 30 subs, which is a lot for a small channel like mine, especially when it's dormant. So I'd like to uh, say welcome to my new subs, and for my subs that have been wondering where the hell I've been, you know, I, it's more or less I haven't been posting anything because I haven't been really posting games that... Maybe people wouldn't want to, you know, necessarily watch. I've been playing mostly Skyrim because this game, Modern Warfare 3, I, I, I don't like it. And, I mean, you guys can like it. Don't hate on me for not liking it, but I just think the game is, uh, it's horrible. Um, I, I can't deal with a game that, that gets me frustrated and, and aggravated. I mean, I do alright in the game. I think I, I'm holding, like, a 260 KD, and I still have a relatively high win-loss, and I, I play by myself the majority of the time. But it's just not fun to me when uh, it's it's not consistent. It's the it's the least consistent Call of Duty ever made, in, in my opinion. And that's what I look for in a shooter. I look for a game that if you're a good player, you're going to consistently do well. I've actually been thinking about going into other games like, uh, like Gears of War, which I'm not very good at. But I figure if I play it, I'll get good at it. And it really, it, it's consistent. Uh, consistent players do well all the time. And there, there's a lot less bullshit in the game. It has dedicated servers. It's my fucking phone goes off. I gotta remember to turn these things off. But, um, yeah, it has dedicated servers. So you're gonna deal with a lot less laggy bullshit. I mean, it's still gonna be there, but no one's gonna have a host advantage on you. People will have pig advantages if they're close to the server, closer to the server than you are. But it won't be as ridiculous as, uh, this, this ridiculous lag comp that's in, uh, Modern Warfare 3. But, uh, yeah, I was thinking about moving to Gears of War 3, or possibly even Halo, which I've never played, because... I, I really don't enjoy it. I wouldn't say I never played it, but I, I've, I've borrowed it off friends before and played online, and I never really enjoyed it because it's, it's kind of slow. But, you know what? It's consistent, and the good players in those games that I just mentioned, they will tend to dominate lobbies all the time. They, they there's The bullshit's just really not there. It, it, the best player is going to win pretty much every gunfight. It's not the same thing for Modern Warfare 3. Not in not the slightest. I would play Black Ops. I mean, I, I'm, not, I'm not saying I'm the best player, because I'm, I'm definitely by far not the best player, but I'm well above, I'm a well above average player, I'm a 3, 3 KD player in, uh, in Call of Duty games, and that generally means I'm not going to lose one-on-one -on -one gunfights, it's just not going to happen. Um, a 3K, the difference between a 3 KD player and a, and a 4 KD player really isn't that much, it's maybe the, the 4, KD player, 4 KD player will move around the map a little bit better, you know, things like that, but when it comes to gun skill, it's going to be very, very similar. So, um, that's why I haven't really been playing Modern Warfare 3, because the consistency, it's, it's just not there. And when the consistency is not there in a shooter, it becomes very frustrating, because there's nothing you can do to combat it. There's nothing I can do to combat lag comp, what, dumb down my internet? I'm not going to, uh, dumb down my internet just to play a game. The game is bad, it, it's broken, they keep tweeting it, they're going to fix it, they've said all these things, they're like fixing lag comp, and notice in the next patch, and you notice nothing. So, yeah, so, um, just a little, uh, question to, to my subs. I was wondering if any of you guys are actually interested in Skyrim, I was, um, thinking about making a uh, making a new save, like I've beat the main quest and I've done a lot of the side quests, and the game is, is just amazing. And for uh, maybe people that are, that are struggling with how to make a good character in the game, or um, people are on the fence about buying the game, I was thinking about starting out a, like a, like a, like a let's play, and, and be like a mage character, or a, or a warrior or something, and just show you the way that you should progress through the game, because I know a lot of people that play Skyrim, and they've they're making balanced characters, and it's really not a good idea to do that. You're going to get to get to uh, points in the game where you get stuck. You kind of want to focus your skills on one area, so I can help people out with those things. So if you guys are interested in, uh, in a Skyrim series, then uh, then I will definitely start one out. But when it comes to uh, Modern Warfare 3, I don't, I don't really see myself playing much of it. I, I play it maybe once a week if a bunch of my friends are on, and that would be the only reason why I won't play by myself anymore. I, I re really only play it to socialize with some people. I try not to take it too serious, but the game is just, it's just trash. So, um, let me know what you think about, uh, the Skyrim, uh, videos, and, uh, who knows, maybe Modern Warfare 3 will get fixed, but I wouldn't hold my breath on it. So, uh, yeah, hopefully I'll, I'll catch you guys soon. Take care.